83 degrees in Topeka right now. The heat index is 105. This dew point 76 is a lot of moisture in the atmosphere. And we have a weak cold front that's moving in that will set off some showers and storms this evening. It's not a widespread soaking of rain, but the atmosphere is unstable enough and there's enough uh, twisting of the wind with height that we could see a tornado or two. That's a, a real risk this evening for our area. Uh, Concordia is behind a cold front, uh, 98 degrees. Doesn't look like a, a cold front, but that's where it is. The winds are shifting direction and the humidity slightly lower. The heat index values are ranging from upper 90s to uh, near 110. So there's the cold front, winds coming in from the northwest behind it, humidity slightly lower, and that will be the uh, mechanism that sets off showers and storms the next uh, few hours. Most likely as we get closer to 6 p.m., this will get a little wild. We have rain right now uh, just across the, uh, the northern part of Nemaha County, but along this cold front as that makes its way eastward slowly through the evening, we'll see some storms popping up. Again, some of them could be severe, and we're probably going to have a tornado warning or two this evening. If we do, of course, you can watch this right here on WIBW TV. We'll have updates uh, we'll live streaming on YouTube, Facebook, the WIBW apps as well. So make sure that you are uh, weather aware this evening. Concordia over to Washington, probably not a risk of seeing severe weather. But if you are long and ahead of this cold front, any of these isolated storms forming along that, not widespread, but any storms that form along that boundary, would rapidly become severe and again have the potential to rotate and we could be dealing with at least a couple of tornadoes. If you have plans to be out and about this evening, I wouldn't change any plans. Just make sure you have the WIBW weather app with you to let you know if there's any danger nearby. There are about 70,000 people using it every month now, but uh, just keep in mind this evening, this uh, bullseye is a 5% risk of tornadoes from the Storm Prediction Center, which uh, is significant. So 72 tonight, a few storms, some of them severe at times. Tomorrow, we have rain uh, ending early in the morning, more rain in the evening, and as we get into Sunday, Sunday morning, there's a widespread batch of rain from morning until about lunchtime, and then after that, looks to be dry for the afternoon on Sunday. Here's the weather room, eight day forecast. Again, a couple of chances the storms are on the way, and the 4th of July also has a rain chance for now. Melissa. Thank you very much, Jeremy. We are going to beat our